What is going on guys? Graves here. Today I'd like to talk about furnishing crafting in the Elder Scrolls Online and how it's kind of a mess unless you do a lot of crafting. Um, it's kind of hard to navigate the screens and know where everything's located. Before I get into all the details, be sure you check out everything down in the description. The community discord, my twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky. You can use code GRAVE for 5% off. And Amazon Associates, that's where I link a lot of the stuff I use every day when making YouTube videos and just gaming in general, some things you might be interested in. And also check out the new merch store that is linked in the description as well. And if you have not hit that sub button, I would appreciate it if you go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Now, when it comes to crafting furniture, this is a way that you can really make your house look different and unique. But when it comes to actually figuring out where everything is located and what you can and cannot craft, that's a different story. Um, it is kind of a clustered mess in my opinion. You have four or five different crafting stations and no real way to search each individual crafting station for what you're looking for. Of course on PC there's some different mods that you can use for crafting. On console we do not have that option. And I think it would be a lot better if they would make a way to navigate crafting a little bit easier. Now if you've played Elder Scrolls Online for a long time you're a person that loves housing, you craft a lot, you probably know where everything is going to be located. But at the same time, as long as I've played and I don't craft as much and design houses as much as some people out there, I still kind of get lost sometimes when I get a new motif. I'm not quite sure where it's located. And this is a bit of an annoyance, especially if you're a brand new player and you're really getting into housing, or even if you've been around for a while and, you're, and you've not really messed with housing until recently, it is a hard thing to navigate through all the different crafting stations. A lot of people out there have talked about this in the past and have said that they would like to have a simpler kind of menu uh, where you go into your house itself when you're inside the home and kind of pull up a crafting tab in general. You don't have to be at a table. You can just pull up a crafting tab in your home and all the things that you have learned are listed there. Some people even have suggested instead of using the tables in your house to craft the individual furniture that you could even use that menu where it shows everything that you can craft and you can craft just from that menu itself. I think that would be a great addition to the game. Uh, it is, like I said, very, very annoying having to get new furniture motifs, try to figure out what table they're located at if you're not familiar with the game or you're not familiar with housing. And like I said, even for me, sometimes I cannot find them. It takes me forever to find the things that I have either purchased or got from drops. And then you have to go in and craft those things individually. It would be a great thing, in my opinion, to have a just crafting tab there when you go into your house. That way you can open up that crafting tab and see everything that you have motifs for and actually have the option to maybe just craft it from there. Or if they would make just one universal table for furnishing and crafting, uh, might be a good idea as well. That way you could go to that table and see everything that you have and maybe have a search option where it can break it down into different, you know, kind of items where it would be, you know, things like tables and chairs and that kind of stuff to maybe lighting or whatever the case may be. That way it can be broken down and, and kind of sifted through a bit easier. Because right now you're having to go through everything at each crafting table. Uh, just, you know, one thing after another. You have no way to search. And it does get a bit of over, uh, overwhelming. And I think it does kind of turn some players off from housing because it is kind of annoying. And it takes so long to decorate a house anyway if you want to get it just right. And adding this kind of the way they have it, uh, you know, made in game where you can't really find things easily and you have so many tables to go to doesn't really help the situation when it comes to time frame anyway of decorating a house. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.